Yo, yo, YouTube, what's good, man? It's your boy Ray here. Yeah? Y'all can see that beautiful, beautiful view behind me, man. It's a nice day outside. It's June 12th, and uh, we pulled up to the sneaker exit, man. Actually, I was just, I just came in there. I've probably been in there for like two, three hours, but I'm shooting the intro now, so. As you can see, if y'all watched my last video, um, the Jordan 2 8 Marino years, gone. My uh, Jordan 1's Marino Blues, gone. My uh, Heritage, gone. Uh, I even had some uh, some uh, Billy Eilish's, um, I forgot the name of them, but the Air Force Ones without straps on them. Gone. I basically sold out in like two minutes, but uh, uh, yeah, I ain't gonna talk your heads off in this one, but uh, yeah, this is the sneaker exit, man. Y'all go ahead and sit back and enjoy the video. Let's go. Alright, so go ahead and introduce yourself, man. Hey, what's happening, man? Y'all already know what it is. Twin Souls in the building. Straight out of Dallas, Fort Worth, Texas, all the way out here in the A. In Atlanta, we've been out here uh, at the Sneaker, uh, sneaker Exit event. You know what I'm saying? We've been following around with Sneaker Exit at a different, different, uh, couple different events. You know what I'm saying? If you're looking to get cashed out, you're looking to make some money, pull up on the Sneaker Exit, man. Y'all right. already know what it is. Y'all can find us on social media at Twin. Underscore soul on all social media, y'all can find. So my first question is, man, do you consider yourself a sneakerhead? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So what sneakers you rocking with? You said, what sneakers you rocking with? Man, I'm rocking with every, if it's part of the culture, if it look good on my feet, I'm going to rock it. You know what I'm saying? I ain't one of those people that I'm team Jordan, I'm team Adidas, or I'm team Yeezy. You okay. know what I'm saying? If it look good with the fit, if it complements the fit real good, then I'll rock it. You know what I'm saying? So New Balances, Adidas, Jordan, all of that. Okay, what you rocking on feet right now? Right bro? now, man, I got the foam runners on with the Nike socks. Yes, sir. <laughs> Yes, sir. Nike socks go with foam runners, but that's it. Foam runners and Adidas slides. I mean, and uh, Yeezy slides. That's it. If you wear any other type of Adidas with the three stars on it, you can't wear a Nike check. But if you got the foam runners on for the Yeezy slides, you can wear a Nike check. All right, man. That's a bet. So let me ask you this. If you had to pick a brand of rock for the rest of your life, Nike, Adidas, or any other brand, which brand would you pick? Bro, I'm going to have to go with Nike. All day. Yeah, yeah. Nike. I got you. All right. Um, do you have ultimate grill or a grill that you may not have but you looking for? Man, that's tough. I had one, but I got it. You know what I'm saying? Which one was, was it? It was, it was the, I ain't gonna lie to you, it was the Rager Bull 5, you know what I'm saying? So I copped the original, I got it, I got the retro version, you know what I'm saying? People ain't too much rocking with the newest version, you know, they was sitting or whatever, they ain't selling, but you know, us OG sneakerheads, they know. OG sneakerheads know, man. All right, so what you talking about? So let's Instagram real quick and take us home real quick. Yeah, all that, all that. You got the website, slogan, Facebook, Twitter, 
Instagram, TikTok, all of that. I appreciate it, bro. Appreciate you, bro. Tag me, you post it, all right? Yeah. Let me give you a call.
Parties and sneakers, bro. Parties and fashion. Oh, so that's there's up, some bro. parties on there. The Shoot. party video is going up. People ain't fucking with my sneakers shit, but I'm trying to get that. I'm, I'm keeping saying it, bro. I'm yeah, doing the same thing, bro. I'm almost at a thousand, bro. Okay. Yeah. I'm like 950, so I'm almost at monetization, bro. You got to keep going, bro. Yeah, yeah. You got to just make a lot of videos, bro. I'm working for, on a star right now. Yeah, put yours in. I got you, bro. Yeah, I'm working on a dog channel, so. Yeah, you need to do that ASAP, bro. You really do. Animals do so good yeah, on you. Got DJ, a DJ, and a, and a do uh, animal right, reproduction. Matter of fact, I just saw the uh, Amy on my ears. That was my on there. My ears. I just saw. Rocking mine, bro. What size you were? Thirteen. Had a rock mine, bro. I sold all my pairs over the weekend, bro. I had four pairs. But how long did it take to ship them for you? Not long. I hit it from in store. I hit the in store pairs. So okay. I, didn't, I didn't win on like online release. See what happened with me was. You, you won the online release? Or yeah, but a buddy hit the online release, but he sent me oh, the link. Shit. So oh, I thought so you paid for the invoice. Exactly. Okay. I thought I got okay. finesse. I ain't never nah, did that before. a long time, bro. Yeah. I bought invoices all the time, bro. Just that people rather sell the shoe for the money. You know what I'm saying? I get it, bro. I completely okay. get it. That way they don't got to buy the shoe. Yeah, yeah. Appreciate you, bro. Thank you. How much you buy the invoice for? Honey? Oh, retail. Oh, yeah, shit. That's love, bro. Free. God damn. Well, that's love retail, bro. That's bro. love right there, bro. The fact that somebody do that shit for retail, because I would definitely would have charged for them shit. Them shit fire, bro. Niggas yeah, like they was gonna sell. Bro, do you see, like, you know what that great part is? Let me yeah. see the pull up. Yep, to the back. Yeah, right here, bro. That is so dope to Ain't me, bro. Ain't that crazy, bro? Yeah. I love these shoes, bro. I ain't gonna lie, man. It's my first twos, though. I never had no twos before, bro. bro. I've been on, if you watched that last video I did, bro, I've been on I'm twos. I'm gonna check it, bro. I watch everybody, bro. I literally watch everybody, bro. I'm a, I'm a YouTube yeah, yeah. sneaker uh, fanatic, bro. All right. That's what Check out that.
Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. He's spending like, uh, 400. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, I'll do 100. <laughs> he missed out. He's not on the table. That's a good idea right there. Yeah, boy, y'all got cash out? Yeah, I got cash out. What's happening? Yeah, okay. And a half. How much you tell him for? Huh? How much you tell him for? 100. That's the deal, though. That's right. That's right. I, I really wanted two, but they was they not selling. Yeah, bro, man. you catching all the steals today, bro. What's up? I'm trying. I'm trying. <laughs> yeah, I already sold it. Hey, you got me. How much selling for? Let's go. Uh, 280. Ooh. Okay. I've been spending all my money. I'm supposed to be selling. Cool. Good deal. How much you got? Five. Five. Twenty. Thanks, sir. Hey, appreciate it, man. Appreciate y'all. Alright, go ahead and introduce yourself, man. My name is Griffin Marchman. Insta Instagram is 478.souls. I've been reselling for about two to three years now. As you can see, we out here, we got the table. The environment's great out here in ATL. So, yeah, that's, that's what I do, who I am. So, where are you from, man? Where are you from? I'm from Macon, Georgia, originally. I'm actually a full time student at UGA. Um, and I'm doing an internship in Atlanta. So I'm kind of bouncing all around, going to different places, different cities. Okay. All right, let me ask you this. Give me, I'm from Nick Do you consider yourself a sneaker here? To be honest, to all the old heads out there, I know it's going to hurt some people. But I consider myself more of a reseller uh, than a sneaker head. But I love the culture. I love the shoes and I buy shoes, so I am a sneakerhead in that sense. Okay. But I don't have the money to build up my collection the way I would like it to be. So like, I'm trying to build up my money, and then I'm gonna start buying stuff for myself. myself, you know what I mean? Okay. So what do you think it takes to call yourself a reseller, or what do you think it takes to make it as a reseller? I mean, really it just comes down to consistency, because there's a lot of people out here who sell, who do different things. But I would say the main thing for me is just being consistent, and um, getting your name out there, meeting people, networking, because I mean, that's really what it comes down to, building these connections, how to get a lot of pairs, how to sell pairs. But all of that just comes down to consistency at the end of the day. And just every day, day in and day out, working hard, and doing what you gotta do, you know what I mean? So as far as the reseller side, what shoe makes you the most money, or what brand makes you the most money? For me, personally, I do a lot of use, so, I mean, Jordan's, Yeezy's, Yeezy's move really well for me. That's the top seller? Um, it's one of the top sellers, and okay. bigger sizes too. Size 12, 13, they move super well. That's the money size now. Money bro. size, now, yeah. like, obviously Jordan 1's, they, everything sells well like that, so. Um, so what's your favorite sneaker? My favorite sneaker's the 3 and the 4. Jordan the Jordan, three, Jordan 4. Okay, okay. I'd probably say the Jordan 4 bread is my favorite shoe of all time. Okay, that's what's up, that's what's that up. Alright, uh, you got a grill or anything or is it the 4 bread? Something you may not have but you probably, may want? Probably my grill is the Kobe 6 branches. Kobe 6? Oh, okay. I have for my side. I love Kobe. I grew up. I've been a Lakers fan since I was like 8 years old. I've always, like, I've had, I used to have a big Kobe collection. I had to sell it because I wanted, I didn't have as much money. Right. But now, like, I want to get those back, but obviously, the prices are crazy on right, Kobe's man. now. But uh, if I could ever get all those Kobe's back, that's what I want to do. Just okay. the collection in general is my grail. Okay, let me ask you this. All right, so just go ahead and drop your Instagram for us again and tell us your name again. Griffin Marchman, 478.souls with a Z, S-O-L-E-Z. Appreciate right, my guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank Hello. you, bro. Yeah. You're gonna be on camera, bro. You said what? You're gonna be on camera. You're gonna be on camera. What's up? Money. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
It was our line. She has to get her Carl's, uh, Carl's keychain, so. See, see, I wanna see, I wanna show you, let me show you. That's all I'm gonna show you. You got another one like this, a different kind, but cool gray, or just the same one? I got another. <laughs> so he gonna see uh, which ones? A different kind of cool gray. Uh, Carl's Kitchen. They're going uh, $10 a piece, two for 15. They got some nice little in here. Let me get you on camera with that, bro. Him for this. <laughs> I like him right here. He fire. Yeah, that's fire. Him right here. All right, so she said uh, she said to get the black. Yeah, I'm glad I got the black one right here. I'm waiting on Buddy to get back. Oh my bad. Try and get it on camera and everything. All right, thank you, thank you, thank you. So 
all right, that's gonna uh, conclude it for this video, man. Um, I hope y'all enjoyed it. Uh, thank y'all for watching, man. There's gonna be more to come, man. Um, yeah, man, just sit back and enjoy it, man. Going for the ride, man. We out here, man. Sneaker eggs, and it's been a good one, man. I'll let y'all later, man. For the passion, for the people, for the culture. I'll let y'all later, man. Peace.